several hundred years ago. It was a peaceful kingdom, isolated from an advanced world. One day, ancient relics, called the machines, were discovered among the ruins. The people of Arland had no idea what to do about them at first. just happened to be visiting the kingdom at the time, showed everyone how to use the machines. Over the next few years, Arland prospered dramatically thanks to the machines, which enabled all citizens to live a life of leisure and luxury. Thank the traveler, the reigning king granted the traveler one wish. The traveler said, Then allow me to run an alchemy workshop in this kingdom. Many years have passed since then. A girl and her alchemy master now reside within that workshop. The girl's name is Rorolina Frixel, but everyone in town just calls her Rorona. I'm, I'm from 
this workshop too, but m um, master, uh, I mean the owner isn't here. Oh, excuse me. Uh, did, did you, do you want a refreshing beverage or, or anything? I should offer you a seat, right? Uh, uh, come on in. Oh, you're already inside. It may help if you just calm down for a second. Oh, so sorry. Calm down, Marona. You can do this. Just take a deep breath. <sighs> do you feel better now? Uh, y yes, thank you. Excellent. Now, first of all, I'm not a customer. I'm a royal messenger. A messenger? That's right. Now, if I understand you correctly, Astrid, the owner, isn't here right now. No, uh, and I don't know where she went or when she'll be back. I see. Then, do you mind taking a message for me? Oh, no, I don't mind. Paper and pen, paper and pen. Oh, okay, I'm ready. By orders of the minister and king, this workshop is to be closed down. Okay, this workshop will be... What? The details will be explained to her in private. Please have her come to the castle as soon as she returns. W wait But... No! Come back! Why is this happening? Ah! What should I do? Is it all my fault? Did I do something wrong? Why did this have to happen while Master's gone? What? I need you, Master! <sighs> you give me no choice but to come out now. I've been here the whole time. I was taking a nap in the next room. Plus, don't call me Master. I told you to call me Big Sister. But that's kind of embarrassing. And, well, that's not the point right now. A royal messenger stopped by and... You don't have to tell me. I heard everything. Oh. Then, why didn't you come out here? I'm sorry, but I just couldn't help myself. I just love to see my dearest pupil panicking. Anyway, they're finally on our tail about this workshop. Hmm. Please, hurry and go to the castle! I'm not in the mood today. Will you go there for me? W but I can't! They asked for you! Well, I'm not going. I need to catch my beauty sleep. I'm counting on you. Master, wait! You can't... Do I really have to go? No! Why do I have to do this? I mean, she always makes me do everything. <sighs> Am I here already? I think this is the first time I've ever been to the castle. <sighs> I'm getting nervous. That messenger guy was scary. Who was scary? Ah! You scared me. <laughs> Sorry about that. Can I help you? You don't look like one of my clients. I, I, I'm actually from the workshop. Uh, this guy. Oh no, I forgot to get his name. Um, huh? The workshop? Oh, I know what's going on now. Come with me, I'll show you the way. look like on the inside. I better not look around too much. 
There he is. That's the guy you're looking for, right? Y yeah, yeah, that's him. Sturk, you've got a visitor. Huh? I think you scared her, Sturk. I did? With that scary look on your face. You have to be nice to girls, you know? Well, have fun. for Astrid. Well, she said she wasn't in the mood, <laughs> so... Some people never change. Do you know her? She's just an old acquaintance. I guess I should introduce myself to you then. My name is Sturkenberg. I'm a knight of this castle. You can call me... Sturkey! Can I call you Sturkey? Please, call me Sturk. Aww, Sturkey is much cuter. Oh, and my name is Verona. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. Anyway, about the workshop. That's right! Why are you closing down our workshop? Is it because Master's never there, and even when she is, she sleeps all day and never works? Or is it because nobody in town likes her, or...? Those are terrible things to say. Though, I guess I should have explained it better. The closing of the workshop isn't official. Yet. We will give you assignments to complete and make our final decision accordingly. Assignments? The Kingdom will assign a job to the workshop, such as... That's about it. I'll let you know when your first assignment is ready. Okay, so what if we fail an assignment over the next three years? Then we will close down the workshop immediately. Oh. Senior Esty, the lady that you met earlier, can help you with interacting with the townspeople. Anyway, I know that was a lot of information to take in all at once, but please make sure to tell Astrid. Yes, of course. I better go back before I forget. Excuse me! Thank you. She's nothing like Astrid. Which is a good thing, I guess. for days. I know, but... Who cares? If the workshop closes, it won't affect anyone one bit. What about me? Corey, you're so mean. Do you remember the reason why you started working there to begin with? Of course. My parents got sick when I was little and Master gave us the medicine to heal them. Yeah, and? But I didn't have any money to pay for. Okay, 
Okay, so what'll happen if the workshop is closed down? Well, I wouldn't be able to work at the workshop, so I'd have to go home. Oh. See? No one's gonna care if the workshop is gone along with that lady. That's kind of sad. Why? Does she even know about this? No. Howard's about to go tell us. Hmm. Then I'll come with you. I can't wait to see the look on her face when she finds out about this. <laughs> Corey, can't we all just get along? No way! Come on, let's go! Like I'm never here. Oh, and you're with the heiress of the Feuerbach family. Don't call me that! Fine, I'll call you Hori then. You know, to be friendly. No! I don't like this, I don't like that. Boy, you're so demanding. I'm not demanding! Oh, please don't fight! Anyway, I went to the castle. I know, I've been waiting for you to come back. We just went off on a tangent because of Cory. I didn't do anything! I see. I knew they weren't going to close down this workshop right away. Can't you at least be a little freaked out? This isn't any fun to watch. Why don't you run around with your hands in the air crying, Oh no, my workshop! Or, I'm being exiled! Panicking won't solve anything. Besides, you seem awfully calm. Why shouldn't I be? <sighs> Rorona, and you call yourself her friend? You're gonna have to leave the kingdom too if the workshop is closed. What? Me too? What are you talking about? Don't drag her down with you! But Rorona owes me a ton of money. I can't let her go until she pays it all back. Or did you think I was going to be nice enough to forget all about that? <sighs> you're right. I forgot your scum rotten through and through. I'll take that as a compliment. Either way, this is a good lesson for you. You can't just lie around all day like you used to. Everything will be all right. As long as you take this seriously. Of course. I'm sure I can do anything if I put my mind to it. Oh, I am so glad to hear that. Anyway, what are you making? Oh, this? It's just a new sign for the workshop. I thought it might drum up some business for us. So, you are putting some thought into this. It's ready. Let's go put it up. Not bad, huh? Aw, it's so cute! Atelier Rorona! We're changing the name of the workshop, too? Wait! What? This workshop is yours from now on. I'm counting on you. No, no! I can't do this! It's impossible! What are you thinking? She's too nice, clumsy, dumb, and sheltered to own a workshop! You didn't have to say all that. It's true. I don't know anything about alchemy. You never taught me anything! Don't worry about that. Here, take this. What? It's got all of the basics of alchemy written inside. My master gave this to me when I started training. It must mean a lot to you. Are you sure you want me to have it? Of course. You're my number one pupil. Master, thank you very much. I'll do my best. No, Rorona, stop. 
She's just tricking you! Oh, I'm so tired from making the sign. I better go take a nap. Hey, wait! Rorona, stop reading that book! What? Oh, Master, please, wait for me! Bye.